those issues that continue to affect the quality of service delivery in our countries. Pertinent to this area is the dwindling adoption of soft skills that define the quality of care for patients. It costs a health worker nothing to be gentle, to be kind, and humane. However, it is very unbecoming to treat any patient with uncaring disposition, which emanates from unprofessionalism amongst health workers. We are recovering from COVID pandemic. This is a recovery period. It's helping us to think differently, to see how best we can improve the quality of our training so that at the end of it, we come up with competence-based students who are not job seekers, but job creators. From the different ailments we have suffered from, so you are a very, very critical members of the society because you help God in the preservation of creation. Because it is until you reach your full stop where you are supposed to end, that is where God says your life ends here. But the struggles of life, the journey we have in life, the different ailments along the way, we are saved by you people. Gathered in this assembly, or we are saved by people who are trained and channeled by you who are gathered in this house. We are advocating that we increase the staffing in these health training institutions. We have adapted to advocate for regular update of the practicing licenses for tutors and the clinical staff that work in our health training institutions and the medical schools. Again, we note that these tutors, the principals, the clinical instructors should act as role models and be up to date as far as the regulatory requirements of them. And therefore, we we'll ensure that we have 100% by the time we come back for the next conference.